hello and welcome guys so in the last tutorial we learned about uh, how to uh, create a local server so that you know you can connect it with your uh, ongoing theme this new theme so we knew how to build the connection and how to use uh, Shopify CLI for uh, you know developing the theme so that's that's the architecture which we wanted uh, and we have that on our local computer so now what we are going to do is we are going to play around it and we are going to create something uh, you know more professional just uh, as a sample I would say I would give you like uh, I'll be I'll be opening up uh, something like this you know we, we are going to design something like this that's a figma design so we have this uh, we have this desktop view and uh, you know we have all sets of uh, sections created so each section would be created uh, you know as you as, as I go on so this would be kind of uh, creating it from scratch so we'll have to add mega menu so uh, you know if, if, if you see that we can we have to add mega menu over here and uh, we have to work on the collection page we have to work on the product page a lot of, lot of things so and uh, we'll have to create pages pages and then FAQ FAQ page uh, and all other sections so I would I would be creating it from completely from scratch so these th these would be the sections which would be created completely from scratch and you are going to learn a lot from this whole you know this whole website creation so we'll get something very similar to this or like I'm just not going to copy this this whole but you know something very similar to this design and uh, I'll ensure that you learn from it more all right so we are going to reutilize some sections for example uh, we can reutilize these sections and these section these sections instead of deleting them completely we are going to re reutilize the behavior of uh, uh, these uh, sections which are being there and um, I, I, I'll try to re uh, you know ensure that we use code in a better way so we are going to code it in a better way all right so just following the standards uh, followed by Shopify nowadays so you know using uh, different different files so that uh, you know the speed of the website is is not affected because Shopify now focuses on the speed more because uh, um, if you are creating components different components it would be easier f uh, for for a person to manage them rather than uh, creating a big component which would be harder to uh, harder to manage plus it would also cause speed issues because you know once a website loads um, if it is divided into component so if if a website if a website loads for example this website and I only wanted three components and uh, I only load those three components see the impact of the those three components would not be too much but you know if I use a complete file full of components all the components then what what would be the impact first of all all those components would load up and then it will search for those those component and then uh, finally it would be showing the results so it would first of all load those all those components but in 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 this case we are just uh, loading the components which are required that is it and um, you know that makes uh, the speed of the website uh, you know the performance of the website like very good and uh, you know it's it, it's it's an approach uh, followed in react so you know it, it just follows the react framework so uh, overall I'll be able to explain everything to you 
but you know it would be on the uh, like in the next tutorials in the next set, set of tutorials so i'll be starting from home page then menu and then collection page uh, after collection page we'll uh, see what what happens with the filters we'll check uh, the product page uh, we'll check uh, the cart page this cart slide and we'll also check uh, these uh, about us page and we'll learn a lot from this so just stay tuned and uh, if you have still not uh, subscribed to my channel do subscribe it and uh, yeah i'll be explaining everything from scratch so lo looking forward in the new video thank you